Good evening and I'm here today with Blue, my daughter's little Dartmoor pony. He's an 11 hands, 11 two native Dartmoor pony and because of that he is shaped a little bit like a barrel. And when I say barrel, I mean like a barrel. He's very round, he's very flat, and we had some problems fitting a saddle to him. I'm gonna show you the saddle that we have on him, and that is the Pee Wee Madalena saddle. So sit back, make yourselves a cup of tea, and hopefully enjoy. moment blue is what we would describe as his winter weight he's just come out of winter you can still he's still got his winter fluffies on and he is a little bit slimmer than normal but you can still see even though he's slimmer than normal he is like a barrel he's very round here and he's very flat here he doesn't have any wither at all he's got big shoulders big shoulders big setback scapula and a big barrel for a belly and because of that, saddles will often try to go side to side on him or slip up his neck a little bit. In the summer, he gets a little bit fatter and his back goes a little bit broader, but that's okay because we can adjust his saddle enough for it to fit him summer and winter. So what is the Pee Wee Madalena saddle? Well, first of all, Madalena is my daughter's name. She's called Maddie. So this saddle was designed for her pony, Blue, here. So this is his very own saddle, and it's now also being sold to lots of other people with similar shaped ponies. So I thought I'd show you the saddle, and I'll show you what makes it really good for these native, broad, round, big-shouldered, fat-bellied, no-withered types. The light is a bit crap in here, so I'm going to take the saddle into the workshop to show you the saddle itself, and then we'll bring it back out and pop it on his back, and I can show you what I've talked about. So here we are at my dining table, and I'm going to show you what makes these little peewee Madalena saddles so brilliant for the little roly-poly types. The ones with flat backs, not very much with the big shoulders, barrel bodies, quite forward girth grooves type of pony or slash horse. Let's get straight into the panels. These here are the panels, the bits that sit on the back of your horse, the bit that touch your horse's back. And very often we'll see little show saddles and that type of saddle with very, very, very thin panels, sometimes a foam panel, sometimes almost no panel at all. These have got flocked panels, and you can see there, they're quite shallow, but they're most definitely soft and squidgy. So they're flocked, but they're very soft, and these back panels are very shallow. Can we see that? And then we look at the panel at the front. Again, it's very soft, it's very squishy. So these ponies that have got quite a lot of their own padding don't need a huge amount of padding in the saddle. And then we look at the tree. So the skeleton inside the saddle, look at the shape it is. It's very flat. It's quite broad, it's broad, and it's flat, and that means it fits the broad, flat-backed types. It's on a traditional wooden sprung tree. There's an element of adjustability in there, but not a lot. The adjusting that we can do is with the flocking. So at the moment, Blue is at his winter weight, which means that we can add a little bit of extra flock in there, and then when he has his summer weight, he doesn't need the extra flocking in there. What else makes it really good? Well, the tree and the panels are the main things that make it sit well, but there's also the girthing. So when we look inside here, we can see it comes as standard with a point strap and then this back strap here. It's like a sliding balance strap. Some say sliding V, Y girth, but it slides and it means it's a slightly adjustable balance strap. So again, really good for horses that move their saddles forward, for horses or ponies that move their saddles from side to side. The girthing is there ready also has velcro knee blocks now the reason that my daughter wanted velcro knee blocks when she designed the saddle was that she wanted to be able to have like jump blocks and showing blocks and all different sorts of blocks because she's got quite long legs for her age and she can find that when her stirrups are a bit too short they come over the knee block so for that reason we'll have this angled jump block for everyday use then she can bring her knee underneath it 
Also, the width through the length of the gullet is nice and wide. So again, for those ponies with the broad back, the broad spinous processes, they're called, you sit really nice and flat. So they're nice and flat, nice and shallow, nice and soft, sit into them on this nice flat tree with girthing specially designed for them. So these will fit anything from like the Dartmoor type, like blue, all the way up to like the Highland Pony. So that anything that's kind of chunky, thick set, big barreled, not much wither, these are fabulous. You'll notice as well, they're quite straight cut here, so they're also really good for showing. They allow that shoulder to be really shown off. These panels are also really short. Can we see there, it's a really short panel compared to the seat. So it's really good for those little compact pony backs or cob backs or those little short ribbed ponies. And like in my case, my daughter's got slightly longer legs. She wants to get a slightly longer legged rider on. We have that increased seat size and that shorter panel. So here we have it on his back. So we can see here it sits back nicely behind his shoulder. The little short panels sit nicely on his little back. And when we look at the girthing here, this point strap sits really nicely for this little forward curved girth groove that he has. And this little cute little balance strap that we have here sits really nicely as well. So the whole thing just sort of sits into him really well. But it doesn't sit so much into him that there's no panel at all. And yet we've still got enough panel here and here to give him some support and some comfort. And for the rider, the seat is nice and squashy, nice and comfortable for little bottoms. So there we have it, the Pee Wee Madalena saddle. Perfect for these little natives and bigger natives. They're perfect for those big shouldered, round bodied, barrel bellied, flat back types for riders that don't want to have too much saddle underneath them. So good for showing, a little bit of working hunter, but in my daughter's case, every day because these changeable knee blocks means she can use it for anything. I hope that was useful. Please don't forget to tune into all my other videos. In the meantime, take care, stay safe, and lots and lots of love.